Hi Scorpio family, it's Elle. I hope everybody is doing well. Um, I don't know why I'm having a brain fart right now. I felt like I had so much to communicate with you guys and my mind just went completely blank. How weird. All right, Scorpio, some of y'all might be a little lost in the sauce right now. Maybe that's the message with that. Uh, drawn a blank, feeling confused, feeling like I don't know what's going on here. I don't know. Before I started the reading, though, the two cards that flew out for my little pre-meditated shuffle energy check-in sesh for you guys was the devil and the strength card. Capricorn Leo energy, but the energy, uh, Scorpio, having to stay strong. The devil might be trying to tempt you in a situation. And yeah, there's a snake here in this picture and depicted, and there's also a snake here. So I feel like it's, again, there's something here that's going to tempt you. The devil's going to try to tempt you in a situation. You're going to have to stay strong in regards to what that is. I hate that being the message coming out right away, but there could be something going on with a lot of interference, eight of swords, energy, mentally, uh, mental obsession in regards to something here as well. So pay attention. Maybe that message has to do with something that some of you have been kind of mentally stuck on or uh, obsessed about whatever, whatever have you, right? So before we get into the reading, don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, share, show your love and support. As always, please keep it positive. Uh, I do interact with you guys in the comments. That's how I connect with your energy to get collective reading messages out to you as well. Um, if you'd like a personal, take advantage of it while you can. I did do it this past weekend and so many people were hitting me up yesterday still wanting to uh, take advantage of the personal. So I've decided for three more days, I am going to uh, offer them at a discounted rate. So uh, much cheaper than they were or a little cheaper than they were. So uh, personals are regularly 40. They're going to be 30 for the next three days. And my same days are going to be 50 and they're normally 60. So take advantage of that while you can. I also just finished up all my same day slots so I have same day available that will be coming out pretty quick as well uh, slots open right now so personals take advantage of that special I will be only doing it for three more days it's a good deal um, also to anybody that's donated I love and appreciate all the love and support these all free are free reading excuse me but um, so if you'd like to donate uh, to show your appreciation, I have Venmo Cash App, a GoFundMe link as well. For those of you that have followed me through my journey, you guys know that I've had to take time off for work, from work and different things in life for surgeries and preparing for surgeries and then dealing with life afterwards and healing. And so I kind of had that up um, just for those that like to help me through, you know, the journey that we've been through this past year as well. So any donations that have been given to me and my family we love and appreciate you guys so so much and i just like to say thank you from the bottom of my heart you are loved and appreciated prayers positive words all that good stuff guys is wonderful and we love it we love it over here <laughs> so let's say our little prayer spirit angels ancestors guides please help me provide scorpio sun moon rising with any messages you would like for them to receive also protect us with your white light of protection through the tarot let's start with a mindset hack what messages do we have for Scorpio today? One more shuffle. Message do we have for Scorpio? Okay, digital detox came out Scorpio. So let's see what's up with this energy. Digital detox. In this modern world of digital technology, it takes intention to create a balance between the physical and digital worlds. According to Nelson, the Nielsen, I hope I'm saying that right, company, the average American spend it, spends a whopping 10 hours a day consuming media via screens and radios. While digital media is a place of our lives, balance and mindfulness, are essential, sorry, while digital media has a place in our lives, balance and mindfulness are essential. Sorry, I hate reading out loud, y'all, but I love these cards. Studies have shown that media over 
use is correlated with lower self-esteem, higher levels of anxiety and depression, toxic content is persuasive, and commercials often rely on fear and shame to sell products. These subtle messages affect us deeply. This week we take a step back. Limit your our use or your use as much as possible to be more mindful about the content you do consume. It will go a long way in protecting your mindset from being hijacked by harmful subliminal forces. Preach, preach, preach. I love it. The, di the digital detox is definitely something I feel like everybody should do. You know, um, you know, social media, Facebook, Instagram, whatever it is, you know, sometimes it's good to just take a break from it, you know, not look at it for a while, not get on it for a long period of time, right? Especially if you find yourself comparing yourself to other people's lives or just feeling depressed or anxious or whatever, right? Um, I think it's great for business, but other than that, you know, I'm not a huge social media person either. If you're watching a whole lot of readings, you know, be careful about the energy you're taking in with readers, readings, you're not watching people that are going to put fear based into your energy or create energy that is fear. Like this card was saying, invoking fear in a situation uh, to sell market, right? To take advantage of you. So be careful with that as well. If you're watching readers, you know, get, you know, don't overdo it basically is what I'm saying with the social media thing. All right because sometimes I get it. We've all been there. You can get lost in the sauce. Like I said at the beginning of the reading, right? Lost in the sauce and want to know, want to know, want to figure it out, want to figure it out. There's just got to be a release. Get the fuck off of social media for a while. Disconnect. Get out into nature. Connect and, uh, you know, start to feel better. Get some answers. Start to connect in a different way. Um, that makes you feel less stressed. It's more organic, right? There's a reason that it makes you feel better. It's organic, it's natural. All right, spirit, not saying that it's not, you know, not saying that it's bad, everybody, you know, I even have to use social media because this is a platform that, I, that I'm on, but you guys understand where I'm going with that message. So let's see, what other messages do we have for Scorpio? I've been avoiding you, okay? You or someone else here has been avoiding one or the other, all right? That's coming out for a reason. Everything they plotted against you has failed. Maybe this is why somebody has been avoiding you in a situation. If you're a divine feminine, there were karmic people mix plural, setting you up. Look, my uh, air purifier just went off as, as soon as I was talking about that. So something is stopped, okay? Or the power was turned off in a situation, right? Somebody has no more power here. It's the message that I'm getting with that. Somebody also knows they fucked up here. What else? I'm done playing games. I don't know who this is. This could be you. You could be in the vibe like, hey, I'm over it. Like, I'm just not in the mood to play games anymore in my life here. Or this is whoever feels like they fucked up here, right? I'm done playing games with you. They never expected you to figure it all out. Angels have been protecting you this whole time. Your best friend stabbed you in the back. Truth is finally coming out in regards to this or will be. are hard to get out so I just kind of take them I love it when you call me daddy all right so somebody is feeling that Scorpio side note kinky little side note <laughs> don't we love it when that happens all right they curse themselves when thinking they were bigger than God mm. Mm -mm -mm. okay 
I feel like this has to do with somebody's best friend that betrayed them. There we ha then we have, I feel the sexual tension when you walk in the room. You're protected or you're very protected, 333. The life has been affected by the practitioner that put a death spell on, but for the karmic. Now has put a death spell on the karmic. Huh? For having them, oh, for having them try a death spell on an earth angel. There's a forbidden love situation here that's really tragic to you. What in the fuck is going on? Scorpio. Somebody's being watched by something, someone also for attempting to have somebody. There could be receipts here or something like that. If somebody was paying a practitioner to do something, there's what that feels like. Receipts, right? Somebody watching some kind of uh, knowledge now of this. Somebody's not happy. Within a few weeks, something's going to happen here. I feel like with that, whatever that practitioner's doing... I think they uh, they went through something kind of bad here, so yeah. Um, mm. All right, what other messages do we have? Should be out there doing that. I just saw jealousy made me do it. So somebody's out here lying about somebody that's an earth angel because they're jealous and having people first had people could be the social media stalker too for some of you uh some of these people could be social media stalkers this may be how they found out about who you really were then we've got a twin flame soulmate reunion i miss your face Somebody's getting ready to have some bad luck in a situation. There's undercover cops involved in the situation. <sighs> Somebody got involved in a situation where now, yeah, whoever was doing dark magic, they're connected to somebody who's got a lot of stuff backfiring in their life. And the police are watching whoever that is for some reason. Within a few weeks, this is going to be coming out. It's a feminine energy that I feel, feel. You've been divinely guided. Somebody is like still connected to this person's energy, but thinking of you. Okay, sexual addictions, addictions. They're stuck in a situation because of uh, addiction here. Somebody, it's a decision was hard for them, but it's you that they really want. Well, they think about you when they pleasure themselves. What the hell? Business proposal on the table. All right, but if the feds are watching this person or there's something weird going on over there, Scorpio, business not on proposal, not on the table, right? I wouldn't get involved in that. External energies working against you or working against someone in a situation, exactly. Somebody watches, somebody's also paying somebody to watch somebody. Can we just not get crazy, right? What's going on in Scorpio season, right? No wonder I got to get so many messages out. <laughs> it's, hey, this is all stuff that needs to be said or talked about or get, you know, it needs to get out to somebody. God is stepping in, though. This is the message with this. There could be a twin flame. If you believe in twin flame or just a soulmate situation coming into your life as well. All right. This could be like this reunion's past life. Like, I miss your face. How do I already know you? How do I feel like I've known you forever? Okay. There's this going on here. God is stepping in. I feel like because there's something here for some of you, it's like you, you're not going to miss this because of this shit. Whatever that is. All right, what other messages do we have for Scorpio? Seven of Pentacles. All right, this is deliverance of prisoners, having patience. Uh, 
some seeds that you've planted are growing. This is helping deliver you from a situation. This is helping God step in, Scorpio. Your angels want you to know. What other messages do we have, excuse me, for Scorpio? Four of Swords, all right? There's a mission, there's a purpose, okay? You're on a mission right now, I feel like, with this energy, right? Spirit is saying, think logically, okay? Think logically, stay strong uh, with the Knight of Swords. Because, yeah, there is somebody watching your moves. Whatever this is, somebody's definitely watching um, the Moon card. But it's going to come out. Cancer Energy. This is also Archangel Gabriel stepping in. This is an angel that has the power to destroy in a situation. Okay, step in and destroy. With the Four of Cups energy, this is protecting from weapons, safety, and travel. Protecting from something bad happening here for some of you. And healing energy, healing from something that's been done. Knight of Pentacles. Some of you, this is like prophet energy. Um, hmm. I also am getting the other message of the King of Pen or I'm sorry, this is the King of Pentacles. Knight of Pentacles is more of a prophet energy. King of Pentacles. Um, This is somebody bringing peace and harmony to the situations, like a boss-like energy. This is somebody that has got a lot of control over financial, uh, or has a lot of financial stability, a business owner. This could be somebody coming into your life. Older Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn energy, three of wands, expansion. Construction of a universe. So this could possibly be for some of you a soulmate energy. Knight of Pentacles. This is going to be slow moving, but it looks like whatever this is, I do feel like that has a bit of a love energy to it. With the Six of Wands, it's going to be long lasting. Slow moving, but a situation here with the potential to be long lasting. This almost feels kind of too like, it's almost like somebody feels like you're their refuge or vice versa, you know? So it's kind of, it's like slow moving, but uh, stable or something feeling. Or this is what it'll feel like, I guess, if it hasn't already happened. If there's something you're moving into. bringing you some flowers here okay if they see you're free and they're trying to I don't know what this is Scorpio woo you I know that sounds corny but you might be receiving some flowers uh, somebody realizes that you enjoy being free maybe this po person I said poison what the fuck all right maybe they have a weird accent <laughs> um likes the fact that you enjoy being free okay because that sounded like almost like a jersey accent all right the number 19 could be significant the number 37 preparation um prepare for some good luck but also prepare for a little competition here in a situation whatever this is or maybe somebody mad about some competition. This person's selfish, whoever that is, though, in regards to that. Somebody's also carrying a rat. So there's somebody in a situation that does play a bit dirty. Be careful. Communication here. Okay, so.
somebody could kind of try to communicate this is tricky energy something to you to piss you off in a situation to uh try to win right try to yeah this is somebody who's got a scarce mentality they're trying to scare you away from something that they want all right so just you know go about your daily routine mind your own business stay in your lane whatever if there's a connection here don't let anybody else mess with you here in regards to whatever that is yeah because this is exposed but uh up up not upright excuse me so somebody trying to come at you with some some stuff here they could even be working together teamwork energy some things in regards to something here to disappoint you or that aren't true you got somebody that basically wants to win here whatever that is all right let's do yin and yang oracle wish fulfillment coming in to your energy here okay i love it scorpio this is basically the ten of cups to me all right after a period of like loss rejection whatever maybe this was fragmented energy you went through a period of time where you've worked on yourself now there's wish fulfillment coming into your energy yeah because we've created self-love here with intentions um, there's also an awakening so somebody possibly has also kind of experienced a spiritual awakening or is con currently right now you're realizing toxic patterns here that are affecting or have affected your life that you felt bound to certain situations it could have been with an Aries Leo Sagittarius energy um, or there could have been something here toxic that had to do with an Aries Leo Sagittarius energy that you still think about this could be what the fragmented energy was in regards to could have anything to do with any of this reading as well there's been a separation here between whatever this is here but there's also karma um things working out if it's a legal situation things working out in your favor the scales balancing out getting justice in some way shape or form even if it's just the universe giving it to you in a different way okay seeds that were planted for something that you wanted to manifest here it started in the spring or coming into fruition will be to within the next week two weeks ish is what i'm hearing all right what other messages do we have for my lovely scorpios The lovers card so some of you might have love on the brain right now um there's also the energy of feeling like there could be a material loss or there's been some type of material loss or a loss in a situation um let's see but the lovers is good when it shows up because it's a mutual thing all right scorpio what's going on here with your energy today Let's get some cards out and get a solid message here. Energy for Scorpio. Chariot card. Nine of Swords. Something's happening here, Scorpio, here in this energy with the, the chariot here. Something is going to be moving forward in your life here in a direction forward movement, a change, a shift. It could be with a partnership, if not, just something moving in a different direction here. Now, you do have the energy of being watched or the energy of kind of somebody watching you but at the same time there's the energy of being protected prayers being answered in the situation so kind of like whatever this is it feels just kind of like okay well all they can really do at this point is still just try to continue to watch scorpio is what it feels like 
Okay, we've got you moving forward, Aquarius energy, Cancer energy. This is feeling protected. This is actually getting something that is well deserved, whether it's recognition for something that you do, a raise, um, being in the spotlight, a platform, whatever this is. Uh, there's something that also somebody came to you here um, in regards to something and, and gave you some truth here. This is uh, fire sign energy, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, a uh, very attractive person. They gave you a truth about something that was hidden from you, air energy, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. So you could be successful in a situation, yeah. Now there's definitely a disappointment here. It could possibly be involving Libra energy with the Five of Cups and this, but here's the scales balancing out. Again, double confirmation. So whatever happened here with this energy, um, things are gonna be working out, especially if there, there's a legal situation. There is disappointment here, Scorpio, but essentially, Whatever you took a loss with financially, I feel like things are gonna work out for you. You're gonna be happy. Here's the Six of Cups energy. There could be something that has to do with children here with this energy as well. Finances, money, some type of a court situation. Um, and the Ace of Wands. Okay, okay. There's some sexual desire going on here, Scorpio. I keep getting, I got this for you yesterday. It's like the energy of, is this a soulmate energy? I don't know, it's like, I feel like, Some of you want something to work out but then there's something that's like uh made you look at something kind of like you want to walk away it's like oh my god this is perfect and then like something happened here here's the snake the devil energy capricorn energy pisces cancer scorpio then it kind of feels like well fuck it that's a failure i'm walking away or it ain't gonna work something happened here hmm. what is underneath that Four of Cups, mixed emotions. Somebody got wishy-washy or somebody feels like somebody's wishy-washy. All right, let's see what your person's energy is. Person's thoughts, emotions, and actions for Scorpio. Thoughts, emotions, and actions for Scorpio. Oh, here he is again. Ass man cannot stay away. This is actually maybe TNA guy, okay? He's got his face buried in her chest and the other one in her ass. So, you know, somebody likes it both, right? So, this is not only ass man. We're going to call this man TNA. All right, TNA guy. Thinking about TNA. <laughs> what? what a perv. Okay, also with the Eight of Pentacles seeing you as somebody they can work with. I don't know what that means, seven of pentacles energy, but somebody is uncomfortable stepping out of a comfort zone. Maybe this person's used to being alone. They're interested in moving into calmer waters or a different direction here, right? Here we go, like tip towing to it. We're not quite at the water, but we're, we're getting there. Um, maybe I'll get there with Scorpio before we even get to the water. All right, how does this person feel emotionally? Mm, five of swords conflicted here why the world card there's some type of a distance here we've got hierophant energy taurus energy aquarius libra gemini <sighs> communication going on that's manipulative there could be somebody at a distance that's manipulating this person communication they're emotionally conflicted about a situation 
see how this card too, it's like somebody's thinking about commitment. There's two women there. He's got his hand in front of the other person's face. So again, there could be just like emotional manipulation going on. They're mentally conflicted about it. All right. What is this person's actions for Scorpio? What actions will this person be taking? Let's do one more. <laughs> All right, Scorpio. It seems like somebody feels like they want to walk away. Then it's like, okay, well, we'll be friends. But this happens. They can't keep their hands off of each other. There's no way that they can. These are the sexy cards. Sorry, y'all. But that's not a friend, obviously, right? So it's like, I, I'm around you. I can't keep my hands off you. Let's figure out, let's get the burdens off my chest. I got to talk about what's going on. Ace of Wands, action, see more action here. Okay, it just feels like this person tries to walk away. It turns into a whole sexual thing that's intense that nobody can walk away from. What other message? I don't like seeing the Seven of Swords want to pop out, but let's see if we can get another message. Five of Cups. Grieving a situation. All right, understanding there has to be, a, there's gonna be grieving a situation, but this is somebody saying, I wanna be alone, Nine of Cups. This is a different person. This woman has dark hair. This woman has red hair. This woman also has dark hair. Then this woman has red hair. So it's like talking to somebody else, cutting something off, and then you've got expansion. It's just like, I feel like here, whatever, this sex is just too good to let go. Or the connection. Knight of Wands. It's probably started off pretty physical. Or well. All right. Let's do a few tea leaf really quick before I end it, guys. What other messages do we have for Scorpio? bag something important such as a new job or a raise coming your way all right what other message for scorpio vase a secret admirer i told you somebody's going to be getting flowers or a gift from somebody who's got their eye on them danger especially with money matters the bear but the bear also represents protection to me with different cards too so kind of like to me, it could also represent like you're being protected also. There is some type of danger in regards to money matters that maybe there is protection. Maybe this is what this, this justice energy is coming in. You feel something is lacking in your life, perhaps money, goals, or love, okay? What other message? And then peace and harmony with the wind chimes. Okay, so you do feel kind of like a peaceful energy, but like there's something you feel like you're lacking here. It could be a relationship with a man here, okay? And then for some of you, there's a reconciliation with someone. This could be a man with dark, long hair. And then a sincere wish will be granted with a needle and thread. Right. I hope this was helpful for someone. Until next time, lots of love and light. Again, if you'd like a personal, that information will be in the description box below, guys. If you'd like to donate, that information is also in the description box below. Bye.